yo what the fuck is up we are back we are back with uh this might be part three or maybe part four episode part four part three i don't know but we're here i literally did a shit ton of side missions i explored the entire castle i even went to the forbidden forest <laughs> i did a shit ton of stuff in this game so um you know you know my character looks a little different now look 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 look, look. yeah Oh yeah. Not only that, but in, in like uh, the cutscenes, my uh, this chick looks uh, look a little, little. Oh yeah. Very nice, very nice. But we did all the side missions um, off stream. The only one that I say for stream is this one, the secret dueling area. Uh, so let's check it out. Let's see what this is all about. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Oh, I'm trying to fix my shit. That's nice to hear. I did take him down to... I did take him down a peg. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? A prize? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? I got it. Get me in the <clears> ring. <throat> Spectacular! Spectacular! Let's begin! Jesus Christ, kid. <laughs> will make you regret signing up yuck who the fuck is that an ogre well man cheer other kids oh so now we can lock in okay okay i got it come bitch stupefy stupefy come bitch get clapped get clapped get clapped <laughs> Whoa! I'm about to cut I'm about to cut No, 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 you're not dead. No, no, no. Shaboing, shaboing. Bitch, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Yeah. Yeah. Easy. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Easy. Hope to see you back here again. Too easy. I was not even concerned one bit, dude. <gasps> Ooh. Rebellion. How do I get in there? That's the real question. Oh well, yellow. All right, let's uh, let's continue the. You know, let's continue the story, man. Highly unlikely. Well, man. <laughs> well, no, it's not something. Rebellion. What are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck? All right, she's just chilling. Okay. Can't hit on can't can't hit on that, you know. She's just vibing out, doing her fucking thing. Oh my god, dude, the audio, the oh my god, so satisfying. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 what was that Beethoven? What the fuck? <laughs> Why were we on the floor, Professor? I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. 
It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Serona and the patrons of the Three Broomsticks not intervened. Mm. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Ra Ragnarok and Rockwood want the locket, sir, about the goblins. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Oh. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. The restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. Okay. But, sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. Okay. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Dude, I really hope he doesn't betray me, man. Cause that's the thing, uh, especially if they're taking the same concepts as the the movie, the movies. These fuckers end up betraying you. <laughs> I don't know. He he seems chill, but at the same time, you know, he he might end up fucking me over. Dun, 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 dun. dun. I believe we have some matters to discuss. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, <gasps> the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs. And when necessary, oh. defending against those who would wish to do exactly us what harm. I needed. Sounds versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're <laughs> finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Okay. You know where to find me once you've finished. Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. <laughs> she gave me a task to. Wait, what? What's cross ones? What is that? The dueling shit? Because if that's the case, then holy fuck, that is not secret whatsoever. Okay, let's see. Excuse me. I probably could have fast traveled, but you know what? Fuck it. It is what it is. Complete a round of uh, spell combinations. Practice with looking uh, brat by. Brat by? I think so. We shall see who shows up. Hello, oh, looking. May I use the training dummy? Hello, looking. Is the next round of crossed wands all set? Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of crossed wands all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Of course. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? One v two. I can't 1v2 it. I'll be dueling solo. Then let's get to it. 
Yeah, I got it. I got it. 1v2. Easy peasy. Ready to get thrashed. Oh my god. Oh, I three of them. Yo, I thought this was two, not three. <laughs> uh, break violence with spells like summoning charm. Target lock, target to change. Okay. Scary. Dumb bitch. Leviosa. Dumb bitch. Don't you talk to me like that. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> I'm bitch. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, Sora, Sora, you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I want it all. Yeah. Pity more people can't watch the jewels. Oh, yeah. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after As that they last should. round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance of winning. <laughs> or at least survive. Sure, the give next me all then. Come on, man. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. I'm ready now. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Where are you going? Come, 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 come. Get into place. Let me talk. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Uh. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. Nicely done. Fuck. You'll get it. Put your bitches up. Okay. One, two, three. There we go. Excellent fall. What else? That's I'd it? say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Oh man. Thank you, Lucan. Enough I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Easy. Too easy. The all finished. Oh man, where are you going? Perhaps I should stick to potions. Oh! Ah, <laughs> uh, one of the fuckers that kill or hurt or defeat her, man. You could have gone a bit easier on Such me. a bitch as a. Seems I'm out of the tournament thanks to you. As you should. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ain't no way a rookie took out. People that been here for what four years? Damn, GG's. Ain't cut out for it. All right, let's see. Dude, I really want to get that uh fire spell thing. <gasps> oh, what's that? Rebellion. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hecate. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. 
Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Okay. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Oh shit. How do you use it though? You have learned enough spells that you need to equip and send to your spell cast to do this. You need to swap it with a different spell. Good work. Oh. Yeah, let's do the build one. <laughs> yeah. We're here. Heavy damage spell that unleashes destructive flames in a short range. Okay. You're getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. One more time. Ah. Oh yeah, dude. Now I can finally do the the um What's it called? Oh, there's a side mission right there. What? Another one. Now we can finally li light up that bridge that was outside. Or like I said uh, at the beginning, I, I already went to the Forbidden Forest and now we can, you know, fire up the, <coughs> the, the webs. For the spiders. Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hecate. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Uh -oh. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. That guy's a fucking dick. Jesus. Yeah, he's definitely involved. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. <laughs> he ends up dying. <laughs> incinerator. In, 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 incinerator. Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Come on, Sebastian. Oh, the flames, maybe? Sebastian, there you are. There you are. Hey, oh. You promised me an explanation for what happened in the three broomsticks. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? Is it a deal with Ron Ranrock? Um, I'm not... Yellow. Seems he's working with Ranrock. And Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Fig had this port, port key to Gringotts. I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. Yo, you're... That map leads to the restricted section. I, I literally you said something small. Serious. <laughs> Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. Understood. Your secret's safe with me. Yep. Whatever it is. Thank you, Sebastian. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight and tell no one. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. Dun, 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 dun. I literally said something small and then she spilled the the everything. <laughs> like Jesus. 
Was that a red marker on the mini map? What? Can we kill them? See there? <gasps> oh, is the time? That's the door we need to reach. Is it time? And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. <gasps> the disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. The visibility Cast one? Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean... I'll actually be able to turn <gasps> Exactly Something what I needed like to. Oh my god. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Shit, give it to me, I'll buy try. it. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Oh. Run! Yo, I got too many spells. <laughs> Fuck, I forgot how to change my, my things. Oh, there we go. Okay. Is it this one? Yeah, it is. Okay. Revelio. Nearby. Okay. Wait, what? How would he notice me? What the fuck? I'm, cu I'm curious as to how long it lasts. Kind of looks like it's uh, permanent. Past librarian still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Damn! You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. Why do we need the key to get inside? What are you talking about? You distract, I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. Whoa, man. When people say trust me, that's when you don't trust. <laughs> the key. Here it is. Is someone there? Is that you, Peeves? I said. Easy. That wasn't so difficult after all. Now. Find that book. Avelia. Avelia. Oh. Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tone by its cover, I say. Okay. Use basic cast while undetected to lure authority figures and enemies to desire location. Okay. Ghost. Don't let her see you. What? Abadakadaba. Um. Surely no one's wandering about in here. You'd be wise to get out of here. It's not safe for young mortals. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god, of course.
Find a book. Ghost, don't let her see you. Oh, uh, okay. So they could see us, even if we're invisible. Well, that's kind of annoying. Oh my god. There we go. Should be in the clear now. No need for us to be skulking about. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne. So she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think you'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Yo, bro, I've, I've told you enough already. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that's kind of sad. <laughs> we just took his shit now. Oh. <laughs> Secrets of the darkest arts. I'm impressed. Oh. <laughs> that could be cool. I wonder if the flame does anything to this thing. Nope. Nothing. gets the librarian with a good excuse for all of this wait i don't want you getting into trouble for me i have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters besides i like having friends who are in my debt hey yo now go good luck in your search now where has that damned poltergeist got to <laughs> Ooh. i know just the spell to repair this armor oh great Jesus. Should we really go in there? Yellow. Oh, a huge ass chest. <coughs> Where might this lead? <laughs> what the fuck? Let 
Your gift, the ancient magic, your kid made by successful attacking or taking damage. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Rebellion. Okay, what do we got? Fuck. Shaboing. What the fuck? Okay. Rebellion. <gasps> What's over here, though? Nothing. Uh, Whoa! Yes. Jesus. Okay. This must be the way forward, but to where? Got a shit ton of people. Um, bitch. For my magic, kind of looks like it. Oh, a memory.
Hmm. There's no water. Okay, some heroes. Oh, hell yeah. The makers of Hogwarts? Okay, okay, it's just a village. Okay, okay. I thought I thought uh, the three guys were the brothers from um, the movies. The one that wanted the, the invisibility cape, uh, the strongest one, and I forgot what was the other one. I don't know if my theory is correct or not. So far, there's no, there hasn't been any uh, evidence for that. Oh, the little girl? You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. Oh, so she My not? father insists it was my imagination running wild, but... It was certainly real to me. But she it has was not your imagination. Age of magic, too. Professor Rackham can see them, too. But we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganok. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. Okay. So what happened? That you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Something must have gone. Whoa, man! <laughs> what was that face? Villain? The villain? The main person behind it? And then there's Sebastian. me. <gasps> We're gonna get caught. We're gonna get caught. Sneaking in the restricted section again. I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. Oh, is it going to get expelled? I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. Ah, oh, come on. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. Careful. There was nobody else. I came alone. Okay. Okay. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> oh my god, this dude, man. Okay, Sebastian, he's he's good in my books. All right, where are we going now? Huh. Return to Professor Fig's classroom. Okay, okay, okay. 
How far is it? Oh, it's not that far. Really not that far. Okay, so before I can even handle the ancient magic, I had to master everything else. Well, that's going to take a while. <laughs> Take the book of Professor uh, to Professor. Oh. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood. What the hell is that? Makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox. Conceivable. It's <laughs> ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. <laughs> Sir, okay. I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Oh, man, don't talk about Thinking it. Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the yep, details. Yep, exactly. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Oh, oh dear. Some oh, come of these pages on. seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic, too. Why those memories? Hmm... Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. Okay. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. That's good. Like in the movies, like the, the, I guess whoever's in control of uh, this, this school, they're like so incredibly fucking strict. Like they don't uh, abide to like uh, whatever is happening in the, the other areas and all that. Like they, the, their ideas is what they only stick to. They are not open minded whatsoever. So that that's uh, definitely smart to uh, to do that. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. <laughs> okay. Hey, level 15. Avelio. Avelio. Defending Hogsmeade against trolls. You know, the fuck is he talking about? Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh. oh. It's time to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed ones. Also, the training dummy is still available. 
Okay. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. I just sent you now. Pause requesting to me here in the lower. Okay. World map? Oh. Oh, holy shit. As you explore, you will remove fog and reveal... Okay. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you. Rebellion. Proceed to see me in my classroom. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's so much shit to do now. Okay. Um... Fuck. Let's see, what was this about? Duke and House, he seems to have a post skin problem. I wonder if I can help him out. That's more of an off stream thing. Um, wait, what? Spell the cross wants meets regularly in the clock tower. I should be able to find Luke in there. The final run of dueling. Honestly, yeah, let's let's do that. Yo, let me. Um, Jesus Christ. There we go. Let's go ahead and do those side missions first. All right, what you got? Future champion coming through. Oh, look, you know, I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Hello again. Is the final round of crossed ones ready? Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of crossed ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Nope. I'll go it alone. Then let's get started. Easy. I got it. We can make this a real victory. Two, three. Okay, not bad. Four. Okay. Spirit. One more than last time. Any more? <laughs> uh, break the red shield damaging. Oh, okay. Oh, you're such a bitch. Yeah. Okay, okay. Ain't no way. What? Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Come on, bitch. Come, bitch. Oh my god, that was kind of hard, dude. What a victory! You've won the tournament! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting started. That was nothing. I'm just getting started. If the best duelists in the school weren't enough competition, then perhaps you should consider transferring to Durmstrang. Now, to the victor goes the prize! <laughs> 
What do I get? And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. I don't know what. I don't know. I don't know that I deserve this. Thank you. It's been an honor. You earned it. You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. <laughs> so does that mean I could go through there now? Hopefully. No? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Fire? No. What? Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Oh, hell no. Okay. Good one. Oh, Jesus. One, two, three. Keep trying. One, two, three. Okay. Oh my god. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Holy shit, that was so hard. Thank god. Impressive wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Even though you won the tournament already, I'm glad to see you haven't stopped training. Stay sharp, my friend. <laughs> I didn't even use. <laughs> okay. All right, now where are we going? Um, like I said, we could, you know, we could do that later. Oh, a class. Okay, say less. Okay, let's see what. Oh, this class. Okay. Oh yeah, I've been waiting for this one. Yo, I need to go get more health. Pungus onion again. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh my god, teacher's oh, pet. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, A little treat for your auntie. Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. <laughs> Jesus, my it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is <laughs> Just knowledge. look at me, dude. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing ball. I look fucking wild compared to everyone else. Now then. Today, we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. <laughs> uh oh, oh, the trailer. Now, everyone, 
Grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Oh, hold it. <laughs> Quickly! Place your mandrake in the new form and cut down the soil! <laughs> Jesus Christ. The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair it. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Yo, what's up with the plant? Plant has anxiety. Is that it? Task, we'll be oh. planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get the best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. Okay. Did you know that you can use the mandrake to defend yourself? Why the very idea? Yes, Professor? Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I nearly went there. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the oh, okay. Hell yeah. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Oh, what? Oh, well okay. Done. Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. Oh yeah, I remember that. You find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Wait, who? Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the who other day. Who are you? Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Oh, Excuse me? you're the dude I killed. You duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Oh. Go on. Grab a few of those cabbages. Just mind your fingers. I almost lost a thumb once. Don't worry. Nurse Blaney put it back on. Trust <laughs> me. You do not want to go through that. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the rest. Oh shit! They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Holy shit, do you talk a lot? Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. 
Yeah, I suppose that could be that could come in handy, sure, but that's just a dummy. I was imagining it already. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Oh, what was that? Vivelio. Okay. Huh? <gasps> oh, what's this? As to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mister. I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. I should Rebellion. think Professor Garlic would be more careful with her mandrakes. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, I'm about to steal everything. I attended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. As in my plants offer so much, don't care much for plants, honestly. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new student. <laughs> she seems chill, dude. She seems like a cool person, a cool teacher. Revenio. Now, if I could plant, the are really um, their new pots only cost me my damned hearing. It... Oh, what is that? We must first understand it. That goes for plants as well as friendships. Kindness and concern are as necessary in the greenhouse as in the great hall. Please, uh, yeah, if I could, like, plan, like, um, medicine, that would be fucking dope as hell, dude. Because as of right now, I need, I definitely Rebellion. need more medicine. Uh, downstairs. Attend potion class. Ooh. Oh, maybe this is where I okay, could craft health. I really hope so, cause you know, Rebellion. I need shit. I need more health potions. Now, maybe all or someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident. Oh, no one else. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. <gasps> exactly what I need. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and Holy heal teachers, a Pen variety Man. of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. Oh yeah. I have you a shell of materials. when you might need it. Yeah, <laughs> like right now. Begin. Okay. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. What the fuck? The delay on the...
Is that one of those teachers that gives you the work and then just waits for you to do it? I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Okay. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. I'll say less. Let me get your resources done. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Bro, no one asked. Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. Why do you want to know? Exactly. Like, what the fuck? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant. You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Weasley. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Oh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. What is it? I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single foop of feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. Yeah, fuck it. I'll get you the foop of feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Foop of feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Okay, say less. Your potion Mongrel uh, fur. Oopo feather. What the fuck is that? Uh, Borgen. Borgen has increased the amount of activity outside of the order. Like, give what you order the representation. Okay. Oh, I have a shit ton of those. Um. I think that's it, right? Yeah, that's it. Precision is key. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an Auror. I wish he talked about it more. And ask him the question, dude. Here's the Fupa feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. All right. Hey, how you Professor doing? Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Yeah, well, I need a shit ton of that. The didn't or crush it. The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. Oh. <gasps> exactly what I need, dude. Okay, okay, okay. I decided to just do it after stream, so, you know, we'll, 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 we'll come back to it. Um, how long is this? A minute? Jesus. Uh, enhances the drinker's chance of success in their... Endeavor, in, endeavors, endeavors, spe specifically by revealing the locations of large chests on the mini map for one in game day. <gasps> oh, oh, so this is loot. Oh, shit. That could be cool. Like, I'll stream when I'm like uh, trying to look for those eye chests. This, yeah, this could definitely be, uh, this could definitely come in handy. I think this is like the deluxe items that I get. Dude, well worth it <laughs> even though there's a lot of bugs in this game for early access it's still worth it it's still worth um playing before everyone else gets to play you know okay i think i only have enough resources for one maybe there's like luck sweets that maybe there's some at um maybe there's some at uh the forbidden forest 
a potion that enhances the drinker's defense by covering them with du durable rocks rocky skin oh this shit was in the trailer as well oh this one's cool this is probably one thing that i'm gonna use like um a lot especially like a uh, at the forbidden forest area since everyone in there is uh, strong as hell Okay, okay, that should be and it. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! Get it! Oh! What the fuck? Dragon dog. What happened? <laughs> well done, Garen. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. Uh oh, his accomplice will answer to me as uh, well. Ah, shit. Revenio. Ah, uh, shit. Here we go. Maybe I could I could leave it brewing. Yeah, let's leave it brewing. Oh, that's smart. You could do that one cent. Are you serious? <laughs> Keep your potion station organized and free of clutter. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. I'd better clean up. You should finish brewing your potion if you haven't already. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's do that. Okay. Then let's talk to this dude real quick. I brewed an edgerous potion, as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Okay. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. Hey, hell yeah. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. Okay, hell yeah. And for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet you. W finessing. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew mm. here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. Oh. That'll be all. Oh, that's what, literally what I just did right now. <laughs> I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Revelio. Ah, okay. Hell yeah. Okay. First, what we're gonna do is, you know, might as well just get this side mission out of the way. Um, since we're here, you know, fuck it. Um, and then we'll do. Oh, I should kept. Damn it! I sure had shit brewing it in the meantime. Ah, fuck it. Spare a moment? I could use your help. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hophouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. Oh, that's nice to hear. I've had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a... a puff scheme. Oh, they seem innocent, but their tongues can be most disturbing. Exactly. I wish more of our fellow students agreed with you. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, 
I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even <laughs> taken to calling me Puffskeen Dunkeen. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Words can be cruel. Thank you. Poppy keeps offering to help me in overcoming my fear, but I'm too afraid to take her up on it. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Oh. Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. Ooh. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of oh an my exceptionally God. dangerous plant of some kind. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Oh, brother, dude. I mean, hey, you know, maybe... Hidden herbology. Maybe I could... Sounds intriguing. Maybe I could use the items there. 